Hey everybody, so today I'm gonna go uh, take the bus. We're gonna go dig through two storage rooms uh, that I went on Friday for uh, the flea market. So hopefully uh, we find some good stuff to load up for Sunday. And uh, I, I think we'll do okay. Uh, all right, on our way out. I had to pull over. They have, uh, there is a trash pile right here. We'll go all the way over. Looks like it might be a winner. Got mirrors. I wonder if that's a steel plate bird. But we'll find out in a second. So trash picking with the bus. Let's see what we find. That's sellable right there. Five, ten bucks. Oh man, be there. That's pretty darn cool. It is a house, like a jack extender. Like for, I don't know. I don't know if the twisty parts. It's getting better. Got all the play school. All right, so we're taking the play school, definitely. That's a good sellable thing for the market. Maybe we'll grab that mirror. Oh, there's so much interesting. Anything else in this? No, oil filters. I guess we should scrap all the aluminum screens. Alright. And a bed frame. Those are always good scrap. It's like a partition or something. Or... I don't know. I think we're going to take that too. Nerf gun. Crazy parrot. Look on nuts, but look at all the play school people. Scrap! Actually, that's sellable, but you need two of them. Oh, is that what it is? I think it is. My son is going to have a heart attack. He loves Beyblades right now. Wow. That is so cool. I don't know, Darwin. If you're watching this, you are a lucky kid. There's a Transformer hood. I don't know. It's definitely cool. All right, I'm gonna open up the bus door. Wonder what else. I love when people are moving. They're all the nicest things. So, I just wonder if there's anything else in here. Cross stick. I think that's sellable. Rollabilities. Look at this. The Nerf gun. Uh, I know what this is. Right here, this is sellable always too. They're, uh, it's for when kids practice baseball for swinging the ball. But I, I should get four or five bucks for that. B hitter. All right, I'll take the aluminum pole. I'm gonna leave the lacrosse sticks. What is that though? I guess the jump rope might be sellable. Or is that just a? Nah, it's just a puller. 
I'm going to steal the carabiner. Um, there's a whole other pile over there. That looks like all garbage, though. Garbage, garbage. Um, I think the toys might be the best thing, though. There's one other box to go through. I can't get this carabiner off. All right, what's this box? We got a trailer light. Eh, I don't think that's anything special. I'm gonna steal this for the bus. It's one of those uh, roadside setup flare thingies. Could always use something like that. And some scrap. So, all right. I think that's it. See you guys at the storage place or maybe another trash pick. We'll I'm pretty happy. Hey, so we finally made it to the storage room. Um, I only made it to the, the unit where I only won one. So it was down here. Um, I gotta go get the key. But if you guys do like the videos and everything and you're watching a bit, Please subscribe. I'm trying to hit the thousand subs, so um, I'd appreciate it. And uh, I'll get to you guys in the unit. All right. So I uh, won this unit for uh, five dollars. Um, I don't know. I hope there's something decent in it. I know that I saw a couple things, but. Definitely a good market for the, or good room for the market. Uh, like this bird cage, figured that had to be worth five bucks. Here's an air mattress. Um, hoping that there's some type of jewelry or something like that. There's a sofa and a bed. The sofas always sell. Uh, but. It's a good room for Columbus. I should do uh, should do some money there. There's all these uh, dining room chairs. I don't know if I'm going to take them to the market or not. What is this? That's oh, a tiki bar sign. Eh? But I don't know. Let's. I think I'll. Uh, Wait, this might be a little, I don't know, it's a bag inside a bag. Eh, it's a fun little display thing. I'll get a couple dollars for it. What do you think? Real coach bag or fake? No, that's not coach. It says Nine West. Sexy stocking, six bucks. Mm. I don't know, this is where I always find money and stuff like that. It, it doesn't look fake. I might say that might be a real coach bag. It's got really good weight. That's one of the way you can tell like a, a real bag versus a fake bag. So if we got, if we got the, the bag and here's some shoes. Um, we might have some jewelry, so we'll have to take some time and go through some of the boxes. Uh, you never know, never know what you're going to find. Man, that is, that is a heel. Maybe I can get Naz to wear those. Um, no, just kidding, Naz. <laughs> uh, I hope you're watching. But, that's, for my $5 investment... The only reason nobody wanted to bid, nobody wanted to move the mattress or the sofa. So I think I'm going to take the sofa, the, at least one or two of them, to, uh, to the market tomorrow. The other, other pain in the butt thing is this dining room table. People hate moving. Oh, wow. I missed that. 
think everybody else did too. See it? It's a flat screen TV. Let's see if you guys, if I back up a little bit. Wow. Man, this room's getting better. All right, I'm getting happy. And we still got a lot more little boxes and everything else to go through. Um, let's see what this stuff is. I don't know, lots of, lots of new, looks like she might have been a party planner or something like that, because this is all holiday party stuff. That's the other fun thing about a room, you always get to figure out what the person did. You never know, uh, never know if they were uh, a business, a homeowner, a football vase. But that, that does make it interesting. And sometimes people pack in a rush. So, you know, there could be anything anywhere in a room. The be one of the better things I found uh, over the last two years, it was wrapped up in a little piece of clothes. There was a pair of gold Tiffany cufflinks. So makes you just want to check everything let's see is that uh clear transparent blah, blah, blah. So this might be good for hanging stickers that are falling off on the bus this glue you try to find like the all weather or you know what i mean assistance eh, that's garbage These Disney uh, snow globes do really well too. I always sell those for at least five, ten bucks. That looks like a choker. Maybe she was a hairstylist. I don't know. What the hell is in her hair? Hand? Is it more of her hair? I guess she wasn't doing a great job. The Mocking J pin. That's pretty cool. I bet that's an online piece. Hunger Games. Got some Canon ink. I haven't really scored on uh, ink online yet. That's one thing I. This one might be a decent one. But every time I try to list it, never, uh, never makes like crazy money or anything. Oh wow, tap shoes. I bet the tap shoes are better online than the ink. I think, and they look pretty clean. I think that might be the the thing to save. Hello Kitty tiger draw, or tiger thing. What's this? Basketball trophy, ballerina trophy. Where'd they go? But, all right, if I find anything else interesting, I'll uh, pull it aside. Uh, I'm super psyched about the TV, and I gotta get over to this side. There's some boxes under here. So, I'll, I'll get back to you. So this is uh, cart one of uh, my $5 room. Definitely, this bird cage, they're gonna Love. I grabbed these three bags. I showed you basically everything else on the cart. Um, the, there's no printer in the in the box. That was the the um, purse box. And I picked out that little uh, ironing board. But in Columbus, all this filler households is what sells. It's not on Sunday. You have to know your market, like when you're packing. Antiques and stuff like you saw in like one of my last couple videos do not sell very well there. I mean, they'll sell if you give them away, but they don't sell like households do. Households always are the bread and butter. And it was, I found this out by mistake. To me, it's... It is what it is. It's kind of interesting. Sometimes you find a treasure, but 
the it's amazing how well uh, usable household cell. There's a lot of a lot of party stuff in this, so I'm guessing she must have been a party planner because I see some more football stuff that she made. So who knows? It, it will do well at the market tomorrow. So uh, I'll go show you the next cart and, uh, and I'll get all this loaded. All right, so I got some of the bulk out in that last, last, ro or last trip. So let's see what's in these three boxes. Uh, now that is scary. <laughs> Looks like a buyer's choice. <sighs> You're ugly. I guess she's a cower cowler. But. Some yarn, sewing stuff, wires. Oh, for beading, that's pretty cool. Beating crafts on that one. Uh, what was in this one? Let's see pillow. Uh, some signs, signs and tablecloths, and a few books. Books are always hit or miss at the flea market. Um, sometimes, sometimes you do amazingly well with books, like reading books, and sometimes just nobody. Nobody cares. And it could be the same genre. It's just people have to be in the mood for it, I guess. This looks like a wine stopper. Some kitchenware. But you guys will definitely see all this at the market as it gets uh, laid out. And we're going to get to the back. And then I'll just show you. So there's some paintings and stuff back here. And a loungy. I guess it's like a snuggie. Ooh. Some more uh Hello Kitty. Two Hello Kitty things. And some folding chairs. So there's there's looks like five or six boxes under here, so alright. I'll show you guys that once I get it over. So I'm at cart number two. Um, there isn't anything really interesting in this, except for I found a new uh, brother's sewing machine. It's in there and it's got a bunch of different things. The only disturbing thing I saw was this scary doll. It was priced at two hundred dollars. <sighs> um, got a two mystery kitchen boxes, fragile, and uh, I don't know. For my five dollars, it's starting to look like a flea market load, so I'm pretty happy. All right, uh, I'll show you the next cart. So I'm at uh, cart three, and. Uh, I got a nice red microwave, a crock pot, a um, bunch, bunch of wrap boxes of kitchenware. So uh, the rest was all party stuff. And party stuff's, again, hit or miss. So it's good, uh, very good uh, flea market stuff. Irons always sell. Um, so I'm not disappointed. All right. I'll show you the next cart. I don't know, so I'm starting to get a nice size pile. But the last cart had, I found this Dell computer. Well, it's, I don't know. Not that old. Uh, I got the pennies, of course. Ooh, a diamond. No. 
Um, another box of miscellaneous. This is a pink bag. Uh, Marilyn Monroe picture. Some more party stuff. And uh, a TV that doesn't look broken. So the TV is, I, I normally get like 30, 40 bucks for them. I know online they sell for like 70, 80, but this is a flea market. So, uh, unless it's a good name, but that's like, I think it's Magnavision. Uh, yeah, Magnavision's the only thing good, good that it has gone for, it's LED. So, uh, uses less energy. But again, thank you guys very, very much for watching. I'll see you guys at the market. Peace.